Hey, this is Mark Moore, aka Tuxedo Mark, in various places on the internet. It's 12:29 p.m. according to computer clock on Tuesday, March 24, 2015. I want to show you something that I got last night. <coughs> hey, dude, the complete series on DVD. As there's a little sticker on the uh, wrapping, all 65 episodes of the Little Wild and Little Strange show on DVD for the first time. Uh, this was put out by uh, Shout Factory, and uh, yeah, so uh, looks like it came out last year but I just recently saw it at Walmart and it sounded good yesterday uh, a little description on the back um, and total running time plus or minus 25 hours which for 65 episodes I guess that's right the only new bonus feature or the only bonus feature at all is a new interview with Christine Taylor who played Melody So, let's see, uh, outside, yeah. uh, how many discs is this? It's not very apparent, but uh, let, let's open it up and find out. Just slide it off. I can preserve this if I want. All right. Do, 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 do. Do, do. Oh. Okay. Let's see. Uh, it's neat. The uh, other side of the insert, you can't really read it because of all the discs are in the way, but the other side of the uh, cover, it's not an insert really, well, it's, a, it's the cover, but uh, on the other side, they have like a little episode list. It tells you uh, which episodes are on which disc. It's too bad that... Uh, there's no easier access to this. Uh, hang on. Let me take the first disc out. Okay, it looks like there are six discs, two per season. And the bonus feature is on season one, disc two. Anyway, let's see what a typical disc looks like. Here's disc one. Season one, disc one. Well, there are different photos on each of the discs. That seems to be when Ted first met Brad. I haven't seen this show since. Wow, possibly uh, the early to mid nineties. Seriously, other than watching some episodes from my. You know, taped off TV VHS tapes, like possibly after the series aired, I might have watched a few of them again, but really, I I haven't watched these in probably around 20 years. So I look forward to watching this. Okay, season one, disc two. Oh, and that was Lucy in the middle of Ted and Brad on the disc one. Season one, disc two, you got Mr. Ernst, Ted, and Melody. It, 
it's neat that uh, each of the discs have a plus or minus running time for the disc itself. Disc 1 was 165 minutes, disc 2 is 140 minutes. Season 1, disc 2 is 165 minutes. Got Danny and Brad. Okay. It's neat that the uh, the disc lay layout is neat. It's got like, well, the whole. I mean, the packaging. It's like, uh, like with the wood on here, it feels like you know, dude ranch. And these uh, little photo inserts are designed like, uh, like tourist uh, postcards, which. I'm sure that the barn on Dude Ranch had so that the guests could send postcards, right? I don't know if any episode actually addressed that, but it's a, it's a nice uh, touch. Season 2, Disc 2, plus or minus 140 minutes. Got Melody and Brad. It's weird, I, I still remember this show very well, even though I haven't seen it in a long time. Okay. Season 3, Disc 1. You got... Jake. He was introduced later. fell in while Ted was off the series briefly, but then Ted came back and Jake stayed. I don't know whose hand that is that is uh, doing something to Jake's hair, I guess, but yeah. Plus or minus 165 minutes. Season 2 disc 2 was plus or minus 140 minutes. Okay. Season 3 disc 2. Plus or minus 140 minutes. Danny and Melody. Oh! Season 4. Season 4. Wait a minute, the, the episode guide... Oh, th oh, there's uh, an additional episode guide on the other side of this, uh, this thing. I have to take out the last disc to be able to read it. This could have been designed a bit better. Anyway, Season 4, Disc 1. Plus or minus 165 minutes. Jake, Ted, and Danny. Right? I believe that's Jake. Okay, so. Season 4, Disc 2. Melody and Brad. Plus or minus 140 minutes. So basically, <coughs> each disc runs over two hours, but less than three. So for a dual layer disc, I assume these are dual layer discs. Uh, the picture quality should be pretty good. The final season. Now, they, they don't call it season five. They call it the final season. The final season, disc one. <coughs> Plus or minus 165 minutes. You got 
Brad, Meldy, Danny, and Jake. It's weird that each of these discs has a uh, and even the back of the box has a Canadian um, rating. It's G, by the way, of course it is. It's a Nickelodeon series. The final season, disc two, plus or minus 140 minutes. Brad and Ted. Okay. So. Yeah, you got season four and five, and then this little thing on the back that says, hats off to ya. You got some photos. That's neat. Did I show off the, uh, Insert from the uh, first sign. I don't know if I did, but here it is. I keep calling it an insert. I'm not sure what you call this, but it's basically just the back of the cover. Okay. Five seasons. That's a lot more than I thought there was. If I recall correctly, all of the episodes have copyright years ranging from 1989 to uh, 1991. And in fact, that's what the, uh, the years on the back of the box say. Focus. Okay, see that? So, it was made over a course of three years. Are they saying they made five seasons over the course of three years? I guess 13 episodes per season. But, I recall reading something on the internet long ago that said that they, they uh, filmed in every season of the year except summer. Because they filmed an actual dude ranch. It was the Tonke Verde guest ranch in Tucson, Arizona. Um, so, I, I, I guess there could have been five seasons. You know, like, each, every 13 episodes would be considered a season. Uh, they, they never actually had any episodes where they were going home after the summer was over and then coming back again. So the impression that this gave off was that this series was just one really long drawn out summer. Anyway, I, I look forward to watching this. Um, so, uh, that's it. I just wanted to share. Um, I probably, I probably never, uh, saw any of the episodes new now that I think about it. I had cable TV, uh, three times over the course of a relatively short period of time, I believe. I'm not sure exactly. Uh... I remember watching Hey Dude on Nickelodeon. I also watched a, f a few other series. The only other scripted series that I watched, although not with as much regularity as this, was Clarissa Explains It All. And I also watched like Double Dare and occasionally Nick Arcade. That was about it, I think. Um, I remember I watched uh, 
reruns of Captain N, the Game Master, on uh, the Family Channel. Uh, they had like a, a lineup called Fun Town, and I watched Captain N, and they showed reruns of seasons one and two. And I remember at the time season three was airing on NBC, so this was the ninety one ninety two TV season. And I also recall uh, Kid Video was on WGN. Um, at the same time as Captain N, and I was often conflicted as to which one to watch. I also remember the first time that we had cable, we had a cable box uh, that was hooked up uh, to the TV, and because we had an old TV that we brought from Chicago, it was, it was one of those dial TVs. So we needed a cable box, but then, like, the second time that we got cable, and the third time, also, I realized we didn't need a cable box, we could just plug the cable directly into the back of the TV, and I think that was when we had got our newer TV. I forget exactly what that was, I think 1994, or 95, I don't remember. But, uh, yeah, the first time that we had cable, we had that cable box, and... I remember watching KD probably at each time that we had cable because even though it ran new episodes only until 1991, it stayed on Nickelodeon for many years after that. I, re I don't know exactly how long, but it, it, was, uh, it was a mainstay on Nickelodeon. And yeah, so uh, I think I remember once time that I had confirmed that I had taped every episode but now I don't have all of my VHS tapes anymore I still have quite a few, quite a few of them but not all of them um, I should probably dig through them to see if I can find any like old hey dude commercials from Nickelodeon or something but yeah so uh, I watched I probably watched this starting in the 91-92 season. It might have been after the series had already aired every uh, every new episode. So I might have been watching it entirely in reruns. Of course, back then I had no way of knowing. I, I didn't, you know, fully get it when the series was old and when it was new. But this uh, this should bring me back uh, to my childhood. Uh, six or seven episodes per disc. That, that's that's cramming it a, a bit. Uh, but we'll we'll see how it does. Uh, so uh, anyway, I think I've talked long enough about this. I'm going to go and watch some of this. Uh, it's 12.48 p.m. and that's it. Thanks for watching.